Hello my dear family members, I know all of you want to be a software developer or app developer. So I want to introduce you with Zigo Cloud. This is a global communication service provider which provides us developer friendly, powerful SDK and APIs to build many communication features on our app such as video call, chat, video conference, live streaming etc. You will be amazed knowing that writing just few lines of code and within 30 minutes using their APIs you can create your own video calling app with some awesome features like direct calling, group calling, live streaming, screen sharing, co-hosting, face beautification, virtual background setting, recording, super resolution and so on. So now to get 10,000 minutes free sign up with me, give your name, last name, country, work email, and give the verification code, and set a password, as soon as you submit, you got the features. So if you need a fully customized video call SDK or any of these, then links are provided in the description box. You can visit that. Okay, let's see both coding questions which were asked in Accenture on campus drive 7 September. So the first question is actually repeated that is climbing stairs and it is third time that is being repeated, right? So please read the question. Actually, I have solved this question in the previous videos. That's why I am not reading this question and I am not giving the solution. Just showing you solution, right? Okay, let's just pause the video and read the question, right? So this was the question. I hope you are pausing the video and reading, right? Okay, and this is the solution. You can pause and write the code or you can write the code by yourself right okay now let's go to the next question that was also repeated that was actually asked on accenture on campus drive 3rd august and it is now again repeated on 7th september that is nullify prefix right so problem statement is you are given an array error of size n you are allowed to perform the following operation any number of times choose any index i such that 0 less than equal to n minus 1 and array i is equal to 0 assign any arbitrary value to array i your task is to maximize the number of indices i such that the prefix sum of the array till index i is 0 more formally maximize the number of indices such that array 0 1 2i is equal to 0 return the maximum number of such indices possible after applying the above operation any number of times input format is this the input consists of two lines the first line contains n an integer n denoting the size of the array the second line contains n space separated integers representing array error the input will be read from the stdin by the candidate right and the output format is this print the maximum number of indexes where the prefix sum is zero and this is the contents that that must be followed that means arbitrary value should lie between minus thousand to thousand and here are the sample input given that is five and this is these are the add elements and the output is three how i am explaining if we give uh, an arbitrary value to this zero as minus two then two minus two will be zero that is uh, being count one right and then two minus two minus one one this will again becomes a zero so it will again increment the count and th th again if we count two plus minus two plus minus one plus one plus zero then we will again get a zero right so we will again increment the count so this way we are actually counting three right so the output is three and in this case also if we do the same that means if input is 4 and elements are this then 0 is itself a 0 so it will count is equal to 1 and now 0 plus 0 is equal to also 0 so it will increment the count to 2 and this will from 0 to this if we add them then it will also give a 0 so it will increment to 3 that the count will be 3 now 
if we do for the same uh, to the ith element i mean the last element then it will also give zero so it will print four right so the count will be four so the output is four okay i hope you have got the logic right so please pause the video and try to solve the problem right i am not solving in this video actually i am giving the solution in the comment section please check that and modify that right i will give a probable solution so please uh, modify that right after all if you need any assistant then please let me know i will be there right okay all the best for your today's exam or your upcoming accenture exam thank you for today's session